Welcome to KJ Disc, hosted by the guy on the left, that is I, with great insight from the guy on the right, KJ Naibo. What are we watching? Yeah, so this is Copenhagen Open, powered by Prodigy Disc. This is Velby Parken. And this is the final round, back nine. Everything gets decided on the first stop of the European Pro Tour. So this is Ville. He's in the hunt. Sharp. Yeah. Yeah, he is rating 10-10. Him and, and Mikael uh, is hunting uh, a place on the podium. Yeah, so Mikael here, he shot seven down through nine holes. So it's very exciting to see if he can keep on that uh, that streak. But here we have the Danish champion in the hunt. Yeah, Christian's blue, 999 rated. Representing and, uh, latitude and frisbee sport, our last hope. <laughs> yeah. Timo Lapinen rating 997. More Finnish people. Yeah, he looks very young and is probably only 15, 16 years. I'm not sure. But, uh, <laughs> could be 26. Could Who be. knows? Yeah. Hold on for 10. You designed this beast that ends all dreams because yeah. this is a tight lane. It is, yeah. And you can choose. It's a split fairway. You want to land it up here. Which is, there is a few gaps. There was definitely more gaps when I designed the hole, but um, we'll let that go. It's 130 meters, and uh, Michael here is gonna show us the sidearm route, going straight at it. Hard, long, and fading clean through the trees. Ladies and gentlemen, so, that's an eagle putt. Yeah, that was great. Follow suit. Here we got Timo. Yeah. He's going low. Oh, that's just as even hard. Better, man. That is the designated route right there. Wow. That was great. I'm going to try that side um, next time I'm out there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because if you try it once, you all of a sudden have a power for it. <laughs> no. Because it makes it out. Hawk left something there. Pinky. Getting out of there, another hog lap, just a yellow one, Ooh. nearly going in, using that backstop on the tree. And Christian here, his approach, go in. Oof. It wow. seems like everyone is going for it now, and it's back nine. <laughs> Everything is on sale. Yeah, it's the last nine holes. I don't know if you can put one of these in. That'd be great. Come on. Give us a knee. No, no, he wasn't even no. trying, huh? He was trying, but he failed in his attempt. Yeah. Oh, oh no. Link here for a round we saw filmed <laughs> with you playing Christian's brother Martin. You did the exact same from the exact please same don't, position. <laughs> please don't. Not necessary. That wound is very big. It's still leaking. Uh, and Christian has that m nightmare to share with you. Maybe you guys can meet up, drink a bottle of oh, red yeah. wine, and hash it out. <laughs> Taking a big uh, inhale and exhale. Moving on to hole 11. Short, straight on a Danish mountain. Yeah, this is a must birdie to get. This is a, only a hole for the Copenhagen Open. And um, it's... Mm, just a pretty straightforward putter shot and uh, leaving it just short of the hill for or a nervy putt or sliding up a little bit yeah it's i don't think it's even that tough of a birdie hole you know that that putt I don't maybe think, it's just because we're not used to elevation in denmark that yeah I everyone think so. steps up to this and is like oh my it's, god i have to putt upwards yeah but i still think it's great that they uh, that we have these holes it's it's just good to get used to it because other every european tour or uh, has a hole like that and uh this is leaking left sit oh, oh no that skipped ob that's, that's OB. skipped ob man i'm so sorry timu but um and here we but were he talking about how easy it was. But he can still 
this all would have been really cruel if Sinus has made a drop zone. <laughs> it would suck, <laughs> but uh, it would have made the hole harder. For How sure. about the the tiny hill was an island? If there was an ah, island that home. would suck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's great, Christian. Wow. That would have been safe. Though. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Laying it up. Having a Talk good, about nervy good, putt. Like, he good, didn't go for it. No. His round was too good of messing it up. I think it was a wise, wise choice. Could get messy. Yeah. Keeping like it up high. Christian's going for the birdie. Yeah, good one. He just got a birdie out. Yeah. Then he's got himself a spot on the podium. Yeah, really here. Nice. But he has a few guys to compete with, and they are unfortunately not slowing down, it looks like. Yeah, Mikkel getting his par here, which... Definitely is the most important thing when you making a good round. Keep and here we have a drone street. flying two different paths. The one on the left is the more straight route, low, and the one on the right is where you go high and over everything. You land in the same area, you gotta clear this corridor to a uh, uh, basket right there on top of the hill. Yeah. A difficult hole. It's it's a long, long, uh, long hole. And he's going over it. Yeah. Landing it somewhere in the fairway. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. And he's probably oh, that's Ooh, his roller. cut roller. Huh? I like it. Interesting. I like that. I haven't seen that. I like it. Ooh, that hook that looks nice, huh? When it's spinning like that. Stop, man. Oh, yeah, Rene, the, Danish the Danish disc, disc golf, golf guy. guy. Got Ooh, some bounce in his getting step. Getting some fame right there. I like it. That's good. Wow, that is perfect. That's where you want to land. You can look straight up at the basket, and it's a slightly straight shot as well into the hill. That is a great shot as well. Oh, yeah. That was Yelte's uh, shoulder swinging. And oh, here we have an approach straight up the middle. Great, man. A little tight on the right, but it's leaving him with a pot. And uh, if he becomes friends with those branches, he'll have himself a birdie. Yeah. It's a little low. Too much any uh, it's close getting over to that skip edge but uh a subpar approach will only leave you with a chance for a great putt wow oh, okay oh, it was leaking caught. all right it was gliding so here villa come on get it up there with straight that. hard Ooh. forehand oh yeah. <laughs> Nice. And remember, guys, Villa and Mikhail is making a charge to get a place on the podium. Okay, Christian. Long Staying birdie in the attempt. Mix. Oh, no, that's too low. It's uphill. Uh, tough putt. That's a long putt. It's uh, But, yeah. Villa. Uphill. Oh, man. They should listen to me when I tell them it's uphill. Timo. Come on. Yep, yeah, there yeah. you go. Very nice. Good. Good birdie. And then Mikel for keeping the streak going. The wrist pop. Yeah, getting that birdie. Getting to nine down. Ooh, Vila takes a bogey. Oh, no. That's no good. No. Christian gets the par. Do my lucky strike. Love the way you ride. And here we are at hole 13. Par 3, 75 meters. Keeping it pretty low here. You don't want to mess up that OB on the, on the road. So you want to 
do this side arm or straight down the middle gap. See, that's you why can... you don't go around. I like to see the shots low, hard, and precise. There you, you go. You can take that. There you go. Fade back, nice and easy. Any fade. See, that's how it's supposed to. That's it looks perfect. so easy. Yeah, that looked like a fairly mid or putter, but probably a mid range. This that is that, that going side around. arm around it. Yeah, it's good yeah, power on that. That's good. Stop. Stop mm, it. Yeah. The green does slope down towards the OB, so uh, if yeah. you want to take the route around, you gotta come in with some hyzer. This could no, it's not. It's perfect. See? Ah, oh. yeah, good shot. Gotta go down the middle. I like it when there's more routes to the basket. So, but um, you know, it's yeah. It's one good, of the easier uh, holes, so it's a must-get if you're in the hunt. Yeah. We there see Christian taking it down. Yeah. Ville as well. Yeah. Good birdie. But was Mikael short? Yeah, he's, he's, uh, that he's was getting a par. Right? Yeah. yeah. He's getting a par. Too bad. Yeah. Ruined another star frame, which means a tree that will not be planted. All because of you, Mike. <laughs> <laughs> Hole 14. Yeah, so this is uh, from Yellow T par 4. Usually this is a par 5. You want to land it around here out of the shadow. And um, then you are uh, approaching the basket with a high spike. And uh, getting the touch without hitting any trees at all. All landed right by the basket. No and get problem. Your birdie. No problem. I think that's why. How many birdies will there be in this round? I'm not, not, not. I don't know. This is. It tricked me. I, I didn't. I don't think I get even a single birdie. On the three rounds. This is uh, fading out. Left. But still, if you want to take the, a few branches, if you want to take the fairway to the green where the drone flow uh, flew, you gotta go right. But since the fairway is overgrown, most people go above. So if you finish left, that's still okay. Yeah, because you're gonna this throw it over anyway. Eyes are, eyes are out. You're gonna that's miss clean. that tree, but that's clean. This is just perfect. Now you're. Uh, Approaching with a high spike hyzer, and that's the any route, and it's not gonna work. It's on the corner low there. He can manage to get his par from there, but this is low. Yeah, not not high enough. I can tell you that there were 13 birdies on this hole. Yeah, it's in a full round. On it the played, final day, it played as the. That was a good upshot there. A good spike. Good second, shot. second most difficult hole. Yeah, yeah. That's good too. I'll leave him with the putt. Great inside the circle. Yeah. Get it to the basket and just a trip circle, leaving him with the tester for sure. Christian here. On a She's knee. Gonna make it on the. Yeah, make it into the circle. Put it on the dance floor. Mm, yeah. Oh, the it wrist looks cops like that basket him. is. Uh, is. Uh, Slanted? Is not leveled. No? But. Uh, oh. Maybe it's just. Uh, now you just gave uh, Timo a great excuse for that missed putt. <laughs> You heard it here first. The basket is not level. <laughs> it's Tor that's not level. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, that's Tor <laughs> that is not level. <laughs> no. <laughs> it, Clean it, it must be because he's so high. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> this is a tricky hole because yeah. you got to go straight at the end. Yeah. So you don't want to fade out or glide into the right. You want to be in the middle here. You want to get into the circle and make that putt. 
It's 118 meters. This was aced during the tournament. I don't think it was on camera. It wasn't this drive. But, uh... Yeah, most holes you gotta clear, uh, like, a gap in the beginning, and then you can fade out to a favorable spot at the end. Yeah, but this, this, is, this thing this would, like, looking... space in the beginning, and then the corridor at the end, so brutal. Oh, that's a good out there from the from the rough. Come on. Yeah, it's fade, leaking fade, right. Fade, fade, fade. Oh, it goes through everything. Nice, man. Inside the circle, six, five, six meters. What a great shot. Yeah. He could go 10 down on the 15 hole. On the final day, this could go big. I think. I think it was like ten down, which been the high. I high, mean, high score. We can already the say Copenhagen Open. at this point that Daniel Davidson, I, I, Davidson is probably gonna win the tournament. But these guys are playing for the second place on the podium yeah and there's big money involved oh man Ville. so every putt counts span it right by the basket not hitting anything so this is mikhail for 10 down oh yeah 10 down that's great i think up until this point i think that was maybe the course record on the round and yeah. we still got so three, three holes more holes to go yeah Three holes left. So hot if he round. can extend that hot round, yeah, he's gonna bring home some nice cash. Yeah. So 16 here, 180 meters. Gonna clear these this gap. Get it out in the opening, and uh, it doesn't matter where you land. You just gotta get out and then throw it on a spike or something maybe a sidearm as well is, is good for the hill skip up the hill a little bit but um you need distance on that second shot this too. Is michael with the sidearm getting out yeah, oh, <laughs> yeah. he was so close to that tree wow great shot nice getting skip it uphill up the hill. as well getting his uh run up a little uphill but Ooh. Kristen didn't make it out. No, hitting the right tree. Oof. Yeah. Good Snuck to make under a skip. those branches. Yeah, that's great. A little further than the red tee here. Get through. Oh. Get through. Yeah. <laughs> Alternate line. Nice. Alternate line. Yeah, that's good. I like being out there. That's pretty good. Kristen, uh. his second drive. Just making sure to hit the, the gap and probably taking a little speed off, but uh, settling very for clever. a par. Yeah, that side I was talking about on the approach. Oh, yeah. Oh, and yeah, on it's this, pretty good. It's it slopes down behind edge. the basket, so you gotta be uh, you gotta come in with some angle or a slow skip. Because yeah, this is looking even better, man. Oh yeah, that is parked. Camera doesn't show it, but it slopes behind the basket, and you can easily roll That's away. That's a putter, I think. Yeah, it was. That was great. Uh, it could be a mid-range, I'm not sure. And he's staring at the slope right there. This is clutch. Oh, yeah. Ah, nice. There you go. Great, Mikael. Ice cold. Oof, yeah. These guys are making putts. Ding. Yay, Jay. Jay, Jay. <laughs> Custom here for the par. Good par. From down there, that's a good, good scramble. And Villa here getting his birdie as well. Nice uh, bounce back from the, uh, the bogey. Yeah. So this is from the Vatby Parking Hill, throwing it down here. You go sidearm by the drone here. 
You could also spike it down there with something stable and high. It is, um, you have less stuff to, meters. You have less stuff to contend with with the, the yeah, forehand. Yeah. The left here, I think, was left to right, so you got to bring it out a little wider than you think. I see he's ending it up on the right side. So the wind carried him a little bit. Oh, that yeah. got a lift, weird lift. Yeah, that is probably a little too high, but... Uh, I guess yeah, that. yeah, a little short, but manageable putt, just outside the circle. So, Emilia is going with the high spike, which is Boom. working Hard. perfectly for him. Christian the same, probably going to follow that line, copy-paste, and... Stoink! <laughs> Wow! <laughs> Ooh, Neil the killed the <laughs> camera left the, guy. Left huh? the mark right there. That could have been my face. Yeah. Thank you, Christian, for. But you were under the trees, right? <laughs> no, I'm just fast. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're the new Jens Lund. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here's Come Mikael. Come on, Mikael here with the for low. The turkey. Oh, oh no! Oh. That was so close, man. Still having the hot round. Yeah, good putt. And still Dimble. in contention for that second place. 20. At this point, uh, Jonas Alto the, is in second place. Uh, and they're close. So on hole 18, Mikael has the birdie for the second place. And Ville has to birdie to get uh, in a tie for third place. Yeah, okay. Wow. It is very tight in the end here. It's very exciting. Christian is probably just playing for his top 10 placement. Or, I don't know, could be better even. But uh, this is 18, par 5, 327 meters. This is the landing zone. It's a uh, half island kind of, so this is all OB and then it gets, gets inbounds around right here. And then you right is OB, power. left is OB. You want to land your second shot right between these trees and the bonfire and then Put it up by the basket, the race basket here, and uh, and the gallery next get, to the gallery. Get that. Uh, Everyone's watching. You gotta make sexy putts up there. Get that birdie. How many birdies are you guessing here on uh, on the final day? Total birdies on this hole. This is pretty good. Sit. Yeah, good sit. That's a good placement, I think. Going a little longer. A little conservative. You could have gone a little uh, further left. I think uh, less than 10 birdies on this hole. Do you want the answer? Why not? I am the keeper of the answers. Yeah, so Mikael. Seven. Seven, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's not an easy uh, hole. This, this, uh, oh no. Oh shit. No. Green flag. Was that green? Green flag. It looked. Red, yeah, like his. Maybe but it's uh, it's yeah, you okay, but as it must be an illusion from the camera because that angle is so weird. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, I'm but, just kidding. <laughs> uh, speaking of the seven birdies, Villet needs a birdie to yeah. fight for uh, third place. So I have to talk about this because when I was playing the island hole here, the spotter was hit right in the ass. <laughs> oh man. And it was he was shouting Ow <laughs> <laughs> It's so funny. But and, and it was not funny at all because it, he was hurt and uh, but but the situation No 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 and he, he kept it inbounds. So he gave all all the the four people that was shooting the hole or playing the hole they get 
they gave him uh, or he gave them the red red flag and they sh- shot him in the ass and he saved the the guy from getting ob <laughs> we're back to the final hole here and this is the upshots and you're just trying to put yourself in a situation to make a sexy putt in front of the gallery yeah that's very it's a little far for putt there but uh so Vila needs that birdie. He does. Come Gotta on. stay clean. Fade Gotta in. stay clean. Oh yeah. Wow. That is That's great. That's a long putt though. Yeah, that is. But Vila's sidearm is pretty good. Going straight. Sit. And this is oh, sealing yeah. the deal. Nice. Very nice. Good shot, Michael. Christian here is just gonna put it close. Yeah, as close as they come. Yeah. Well Good done. Good shot. Here's for third place. Tied for third. He needs that for going to the playoff. Boom! Ooh, man. You can tell he wanted that. Yeah. Oh. Pick jump. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Oh, good catch. Last chain. Yay, Jay. Yeah. Christian here for his total of minus six on the final round. Very, very respectable. Yeah, minus 17 total. Had a great tournament. Yeah. He beat me by six. So. Well, he I didn't. I don't know beat if the... it's saying anything about my game. <laughs> <laughs> well. The fact that he's uh, not even in contention says a lot about the Finnish people. Because yeah. we're going to playoffs. Yeah. So this is against Ville. And this is Ville playing against Jonas Alto yeah. for third place. This is Jonas's drive. Good sidearms. And, and Ville's uh, sidearm clipped something. So he's left behind here. Getting a nice backhand approach. A little short, but long putt, huh? That is probably 15 meters, maybe a little bit more. And Jonas just needs to put Leaking it Leaking it left here a little bit, but still, yeah. This is a long putt. Boom! Wow, man. <laughs> Running it in. Damn, that was pretty far. Yup. <laughs> that was maybe 17 meters? I don't know. Maybe yep. more. It's definitely circle two edge. Kind and of. That's putting the pressure on Jonas. Oh, oh you going low. Don't want to leave it short there, but okay. Great rounds from Kay. Mikael and Ville. Yeah. Coming from Chase Card taking second and third place in the tournament. Wow. That's great. That's how you chase. That's how you chase, man. And first place for Daniel Davidson. He played great all weekend and there was never really a doubt. But great fight from Mikael and Jonas and Ville. So Christian shooting a six down, ending up a tied for ninth. And Jelte Jensen, the Danish young gun, uh, came in shooting a hot round at nine, finishing up in the eighth place. We have two Danes in a sea of Finnish people. Congratulations to the nation of Finland. Yeah. Hopefully we'll see you next time. Our next stop will be Kogadal Oben. It's so. gonna be a blast and also stay tuned to the European Pro Tour. They have amazing stops coming up, so make sure to check out their coverage. Like and subscribe. See you next time. Bye. Bye.